The video game industry has taken a turn with the release of the new PlayStation VR, a virtual reality headset that allows gamers to not only play their favourite games, they can be in them too. Here's Matt Hoy with more. Video games, the fast developing entertainment that is quickly taking over our imagination and living rooms. Even with dominant gaming titles such as FIFA, NBA 2K and Gears of War all releasing their latest instalments to their franchises recently, it's another platform that has taken the gaming world by storm, virtual reality. I caught up with gaming expert and YouTuber Will Ramsey, who explained how the immersive new gaming concept of virtual reality has become the latest craze in gaming. Yeah, people are always looking for like big graphics and, and big open world games and VR kind of enhances that experience. Vive and PlayStation VR are leading the charge, selling over 40 million units worldwide since release. The headset allows you to step into a virtually created world, literally. The controllers become the tools you need to navigate your way through the digitally created reality, and the rest is up to you. Titles like Batman Arkham VR, Resident Evil 7 and Battlezone are already on the market, allowing gamers to take the reins as Gotham's vigilante or even fight a zombie apocalypse with their own hands. So it's a frustrating period to be working with all this stuff because even, even though it's really fun and exciting, we sort of know where it's heading and we know that it's going to be that much better. The immersive new experience is just at the beginning of what is said to be the future of gaming, leaving the industry with seemingly endless possibilities of creating new and exciting content. But why is it so good? Simple. It's different. It's just like an entirely new conscious reality experience. Like we only really know dreaming and the waking state and VR, to me anyway, is like a whole new reality. It's a whole new experience. You find yourself in a world. The PlayStation has been out for a while now. However, with the latest release of the PlayStation VR, players will be ditching these for these. The new gaming systems come at a price, with the HTC Vive selling for about $900, while the PlayStation VR can be bought for around $550. For hardcore gamers and newcomers alike, it's definitely a price worth paying. Matt Hoy, Mojo TV.